history with weight. So I was always like the chubby kid, like always. <laughs> um, I remember being called bubble butt the first time when I was about seven years old and I got bullied a ton. Um, anyway, so went from being the chubby kid to the chubby teenager. Um, and then um, in my early 20s, I developed full on binge eating disorder. And after that, I, I spent the majority of my 20s morbidly obese. So um, I thought that I would share with you guys today the before and after pictures of my 100 pound weight loss journey. Keep in mind that I'm not done yet. I would like to drop another 18 to 25, 28 pounds um, to chisel out my abs and my booty a little bit more. So um, keep that in mind, be kind. What were my body stats before and after? Okay, so I started out at 290 pounds, and like that was my heaviest. And at the time I was between a size 18 and 20 in pants, US women's sizes, and my tops were a 2XL. And now my tops are between a small and a medium, depending on how much room they have, because I'm, I'm still a D cup. Um, so I have to find tops that like give me a little room up there. And then my bottoms have ranged between a US women's size four and six. Before I forget, please make sure that to like this video and subscribe so that you can follow along as I share the rest of my fitness journey as well. How long did it take me to lose 100 pounds? Well, the bulk of it I lost in about four months of really buckling down and making my health a priority. But the majority of my issues was figuring out what was causing my binge eating disorder and then getting to the root cause of that. And then I also had to do a year of therapy and heal from a lot of trauma. And then the rest has just been developing healthy habits and not giving up on myself. So like I said, that was a total of about four years. What I hope that you all take away from this video is to realize that you just gotta be gentle with yourself. You need to pick yourself back up as many times as you fall, like literally promise yourself that. And I mean, I find it incredibly helpful and motivating to see other people's success. So as you're making success, share your story. You got this. You can do it too.